one will back to pull solo. I'm very sorry for the long wait. Um, we're back to looking for their friend, who is in one of these buildings somewhere. Where are you? No, you're somewhere in these. There you are. Hello! You guys, but what are you? Hey, did you really think we'd let you face the world alone? I... You're following a trail of the ancients, aren't you? I might as well. It's as good as a direction as a when you have nowhere to go. I should have came with you right away. I'm sorry. Now I'm the one to shoot apart. <coughs> Especially to you. I'm sorry. I should have said something to you too. Please don't be mad. You're so, so stupid. Yeah, I guess I am. But let's keep that between us, shall we? I don't want anyone else to know. Haha, <laughs> you're so silly. Friends again, little brother? Friends. Ah, somebody better bring me some tissue, cause I can feel the good cry coming on. Cry you! The ancients must have gone north from here, through the canyons. I wonder what we'll find. What about the ninja looking people here? Uh, <laughs> That's kind of a weird thing to see an NPC say. Some women do enjoy... Well... But I'm not one of them. Oh, now that just made the whole fucking thing funny. <laughs> it's ten gold a night? Nah. Can't get past though. Okay. Well, first thing we'll want to do is look for the weapon shop. Looking without buying is considered stealing. Uh got a weird comment. Chance of critical hits, small fire damage, and may not be used on camels. What? I still have money for the... Without buying? <laughs> um... <laughs> she has a bow. No, no way meant. That'd be used on camels. <laughs> Weird. Uh, proves. Okay, that's a improvement, so, uh. Go ahead. Now, nah, so improves his. That's just for me to throw. What if I just sell then, huh? Then what? Quick sell and kind of weird how it selects the kill. Them. Guess it's just uh, double check to make sure. <coughs> Potion. Yeah, we'll keep the rest of that. Hey, okay, we're gonna probably want to grind a little. random amount of MP. Wow, that's a lot of money for something like that. <clears throat> the less price. 
something that can make my customers happy instead. Buy two for. Yeah. Warranty. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to grind a bit, so... Let's go find the local dungeon, and let's see what we can wassle up some. No. We won't show off a grinding way. Oop. Hey, excuse me. <gasps> Ellipses! We're looking for something and we're wondering if... Wow, that guy sure is in a hoy. Yeah! Let's follow him! Hmm... Should we bother following him or should we... Yeah, let's, let's go try following him, I guess. What's the worst could happen? We all die? Well, I should save. There we go. They made a lot of stuff crawling around you. You just got Fire Gym, got Ando. Here we go! <laughs> Ambush! Oh! Oh! Bootastic! I should kill off the smallest stuff first. They don't know how strong the stuff is, so... Ooh, the stuff here hits kinda hard. Now, actually, maybe we will grind a little bit. Grind a little bit, upgrade our gear, and then we'll go off exploring for him, so, um... We'll continue this in a bit. Oh, shite! Oh, are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, we're, we're going to need a little update here. Let's see how much we get off here. Okay. Yeah, we're going to do a little walk. Okay, see you in the next video. Oh. Hello everyone, welcome. We're back. And we're going to go and explore some here. And see where we're going. Um, we made sure we bought lots of orbs. Ooh. Even after getting a few levels, some of the stuff here hurts pretty bad still. I'm gonna get with the big guys first. Now, um, I've practiced a little with the, uh, gathering system, which is quite interesting, to be honest. Um, basically, uh, the main character hasn't learned anything that uses gather yet, but, uh, our other two characters have learned something that requires a gather. And it's, uh, kinda interesting. It seems to add a little extra damage. Uh, to your physical attack while also allowing you to cast uh, stuff that requires gather. So you just got a pepple power. Pep. Uh, pep. <laughs> Let's see what that is. Quick, uh, item wakes up Kelo from death. It's a revival item. Which we have not found any of those for sale yet. So we're gonna have to look around here because we gotta find that one person. Just got middle coins. And we got a potion. Find a few things. Where are the metal coins, though? Hmm. There must be some kind of value of money then, because they're not in the inventory. I found gold coins, which I assumed was, you know, gold. So I'm not really sure what silver coins are supposed to be. And eh, nothing up there. Seems to be no secret path. So I guess we need to go back in the force cave. <coughs> Pardon me. <laughs> oh. See, that's what makes uh, this area pretty annoying. See, look at all that. They just... They ganged up on him, he got poisoned, and the poison did 51 damage. 51 damage. That's a lot of damage. Now, let's see. We bought a lot of holds. Let's see how much, uh, 
One hole will heal full. Now, oh crap. One of the things with uh, poison is, there's a chance you'll randomly lose control. So, we're not like 100% sure what the hell he will do. Um, Percentage-wise, I'm not really sure. But, overall, he doesn't always listen to you poisoned. So we really want to get the sandworm killed heal. Because he's the one that poisons things. Once he's gone... There we go. Not really a problem anymore. Now we need... Actually, since she can kill him in one hit... Let's try... To just let those two heal and she attacks, because she can kill them in one hit. If you don't kill them in one hit, they barely underground for a while. Yeah, he actually did it. There we go. And we'll finish him off a few holds. Because we're gonna try and save the magic. There we go. Okay. Now we didn't get to fully explore the force cave because, um, as you uh, remember, they were kicking our ass. Now we're a little stronger and they're still a bit painful, but we can at least defend back. Let's see, should we go right here? Or... Let's see. Oh, there's him. So that's continuing on, so let's go the other way. Because that's probably going to lead to side treasures. Ooh, that's what that is. Obviously, looks like a weapon. Oh, that's the one we got from town. Okay, so that's just the extra now. Now, chest. Gold coins. <coughs> Bomb me again. A lot of cold weather down here in Missouri right now. Let's see, hold. And a chest. Apparently, can't get to. Oh, deal. Uh, we probably want one from this one now. Uh, Oh crap. They found... We can easily kill this at the cost of some of our magic and... Like I said, we want to try and avoid using our magic, because... Well, I don't really know a reason, it's just something generally you want to really do, usually. That's a... Uh... Yeah. Huh. Well, that was solely bizarre. It teleported us. Huh. Oh well. Oh, quid. Got the advantage. Should be able to win away. See, um, a little uh, mechanic friend in the back has a uh, hit all fireball spell. Costs 20 of his. requires a key. So we need to get a key. Key, 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 we need a key. Dynamite. They're supposed to get that one now. I think maybe we will post to walk up that. Let's see if we can force go on this side. No. Hmm. Not sure if you can walk up that stuff. Let's go back real quick. Make sure we... Don't look like you could. No? It looks... Hmm. So there must be a trick to that. We might have to look into it about later. Oh! By the way, just a tip, um, I've made uh, our little friend here immune to poison. 
He has a vaccine that's so sweet. It's not the swine flu, by the way. Um, if you go to the, uh, I believe it's called the uh, headquarters on the forest island you start on. Um, after I got all, I decided to uh, explore a little on some of those other places I didn't really go to. And there was a bounty hunter who uh, basically forces you to go and unlock that chest that was locked in the forest. And uh, that's this, you come back and uh, you get an opportunity to uh, not give it back to him. Because he's a criminal, so uh, we sent him to jail and got to keep his treasure. Because we don't stand criminals. Criminals are bad. Let's see, here we go. Yeah, dudes. We got a few of those, but as you can see, uh, poison does not kill you on oval. See, eh. See, I just want to be careful, because a mainly void. Ooh. Kick those things, but I'm mainly worried about any kind of boss we might fight. Still pretty early in the game, and we don't have very high healing sources right now, so I'm always very iffy at the beginning of a RPG that way. When there ain't a lot of healing source, I'm pretty iffy. Okay, so anyway, Ooh, there's a lock chest. So let's continue on here. Metal coins. Hmm. Gold coins. And then exit. Okay. We got the advantage, so we definitely got a good shot at killing the sand wall real quick. Yeah. Die. There you go. Our heal is the strongest kill, though. Crazy, ain't it? Attack the other one, because this one's probably going to go underground, actually. Oh, there we go. He can one charm too now. Oh, actually, he did more damage on that. <laughs> okay. Let's see what's out here first. No cave. Ooh, we got a sword. For a main kill though, and it does one more damage. So we'll go ahead and snatch that. Don't appear to be any secret. Oop. Yeah, we want to try and avoid this really big mob heal. The whale down our resources. Run away! Come on, there you go. We don't want to be getting everyone poisoned. Okay. Well, let's go the other way real quick and see what's that way before we go in that cave. Because I'm going to assume that's going forward since. So it's down here. Nope. I'm so exhausted. Are you okay? <gasps> oh well, no! Uh, I don't feel good either. Come on, guys. Oh, what? Oh, look. It's a stranger. Go on man hunt. And that strain and that stranger wakes up. Where am I? Within my hut's humble embrace, I must admit your persistence is ample, but followed me for miles, but of course nature has a way her way in the end, and I found the three of you passed out in the valley. I'm so thirsty. The desert sun makes even water sparkle like diamond. Heal. Drink this. Thanks, how do you know my name? It's less mysterious than it appears. Your friends told me. Are they okay? As fit as you, my boy. Merely look at to your left. Come out and join us on your way. 
We'll be waiting. Wait, what's your name? I answer to Mahu. I see. Thank you, Mahu. You're welcome. I see. That's quite a tale, children. You've came a long way. You're awake. You were so worried. I'm glad to see you okay, too. This is Tagamore, our host. Hello, so I'm very grateful for all your help. I'm gra a grateful guest, considerably more agreeable than our young lady here. What does he mean? I hit him. What? I didn't know who he was, and I was... <laughs> no, Mal. I've been struck hard for lesser deeds. Your friends have told me all about your journey. This has been quite a week for you three. Yeah. I suppose you always guess who we are. Um... The Wandering Ones? The Vogbound who clutch at the strings of the past? I really... This is why I hate children. <laughs> Not much for... This man... These men are... Your ancestors had built the ruins of Wajin. That's true. We are indeed descendants the ones you seek. I always imagined... <laughs> it took them far enough. They sailed near the mountains near here. And there they remained. That's such a sad story to be driven out by, well, by us. The past can walk the soul when dwelled upon for too long. Forgivably, humanity has forgotten about us since that time. Today, almost no one even knows we even exist. Almost. Your scholars mostly, though. They insist is particularly zoology. It's been a while since we've had any visitors, though. I see. Now then, I'm afraid our meeting cannot purely for pleasure. We must ask a kindness. Anything. We owe you our lives. Our ground is sacred. We are known, yes, but the few who take interest in us, the bell, will tolerate you within our grounds, but we shan't be pleased if more of your kind come along looking for us. Keep our location only your hands and hearts. You need it, Roy. We won't tell us all, right? Me? I can keep a secret. Thank you. Now then, I'm sure you want to stretch your legs a bit. Just know that you can stay as long as you like and that you'll always be welcome here. You're grateful. Anything in any of these pots? Nope. Oh, didn't mean to walk out yet. Go back in real quick. Now then, I'm sure you're just... Yeah. Say, so what happened to the West of your kind? Why aren't you with them in the mountains? They're all gone, I'm afraid. When I was young, a disease hit our village, and... Only I survived, and meth took me in. We are the last of our kind. I'm so sorry. So am I. Are you sure it's okay for us to stay here? We don't really want to intrude on you guys. It's alright. We're glad to have you here. We can sense the good in your hearts. Okay, climb up the ladder, so, um, yeah. Get stretch our legs. Back to the canyon. More of the canyon. So it's kind of like a midpoint. I wonder if we can west here, actually. Oh wait, we're glad. I want to ask you something. The wall mentioned the name Be Behithia. And you want to know who she was, I take it? Well, yes. I cannot comment on what you found, but there is an old tale. What kind of tale? Long ago, the gods constructed a machine of enormous power. The goal was to make a world bell for mankind. Fate had other plans, though, and it disappeared overnight in a sea of fire. 
The entire city crumbled in its wake. One of the gods was... She is also said to have built our city as a refuge of, for our kind. Are you sure? As sure as one dares to be about stories. You're right. It's hard to separate legend from fact. Pretty much all of our ancient historians are told in the form of myths. They have to be. We have no one record of that period. It's called the Lost Age, right? Scholars call it that. I'm not sure how many people today are interested in it. I see, well, maybe that era would be best forgotten. What do you mean? As I said before, the past is best left behind. It's a rule that served us well. Is there something you're not telling us? Was that the case, it would be for good reason. Please, sir, if you know more, tell us. You should know better than to dwell on the words of an old man. Why is there no gate, uh, gate guarding in this hut? I refuse to live like a caged animal. That's why I left the village to begin with. Aren't you afraid of humans finding you? The desert is a very foreboding place. Not many visitors venture this far. Unless they're as crazy as we are, huh? I would sooner say that you are curious, but your assumption of yourselves carries more weight. Well. Hey, Muriel. Yes? That village of yours. We would very much like to see it. There's not much to see. It's a tomb now, home of lost spirits. Besides, you could not enter anyway. Why not? It's hidden deep inside the mountain, and the magic gate bars all humans from entering. Only our kind is grand passage. I don't know how you managed to enter the gate, and perhaps the old spells have begun to wear off, but I assure you this will not happen here. This gate is still in very good shape. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I will love to see it. Me too. You feel that strongly about it? I grew up in a family of archaeologists. <coughs> Archaeologists. <coughs> Archaeologists. I know I can't say it. Uh, it breaks my heart to think that it might be lost forever because I'm guessing neither you nor your master will ever be returning now. Actually, I do have some business though. There was something I left behind that I would very much like to recover, but the caves are dangerous and I couldn't go back there alone. What about your master? Couldn't he go with you? It would be too dangerous for a man his age. I'm afraid. Besides, he wants me to leave it alone. Oh, so what is this thing? Well, it's... let's just say it's a pawn to me. If you say so. Of course, if some strong adventurers were to help me get to the cave, I suppose I could return a favor. Ah, I see what you're getting at. <laughs> so, what do you all say? Well, we can go anytime you want. Well then, the cave entrance is to the northwest. Let's be on our way, shall we? Ah! And so he joins. Let's see. Starts at level 6. 300. 100. He's not equipped with 8. So. Let's give him the extra author accessory we got. And. Don't got anything else he can equip. So he got the author thing. Probably not a big deal though. Um, sweet home. What the hell? It teleports us! So you're finally going back. I'm sorry, Master. I know you don't want me to, but I can't leave it, though. It won't change anything, you know. It would be best to leave it buried. I'm sorry, but I disagree. I know. I just hope you won't regret it. Okay. So that what turns us heal. Do you like the way down? Yeah, there we go. So we can actually west here. That's good. That's what I was hoping for. <laughs> good thing we were very persistent about that. So we got a free bid. And he got a spell that teleports it. I wonder if he could teleport us from anywhere. Hmm. 
Well, we're stuck in here, it looks like, so... First thing I want to do is... Oh. No, he won't want this. No deal. That means we can't go back to the shop. Good thing I loaded up on a lot of holds and stuff then. Okay, so we're forced to go forward then. Go hold. It's a, such a jump, dumb laws. I just picked my nose on. Hey, what a buy. Oh, well, the programmers were small enough to give us a merchant. Uh, berries. That. Ooh, damn. A little expensive, though. Oh, he sells the uh, one item. Pretty sure those are all. Look, yeah, those are much more expensive than the uh, secret cheap march in the town. It'd be nice to buy a few of those. At least I don't have to pay taxes now. <laughs> you just got a. Oh, what the heck is that? Look, there, there it is. Kills both sleep and poison. It's a double jeopardy item. Oh dear. Hmm. Hmm. Well, we got four killers now. We could give it a try. Definitely want to kill the sulfur force. I want to see. Uh. He needs uh, one gavel to use heavily blow. Well, I'm not sure how strong an attack he'll do. What's it called? Gold blow? <laughs> okay, let's see what he can do. Not bad. Not sucky damage. So let's see. Have you and you attack the snails. You two can attack the gooey jelly. Ow! Camel attacked. And apparently, it sticks really good against the gooey things. Let's see. Come out of your dang hole. There you go. Yeah, it's much better with a fourth kill, though. He's not bad. Not too bad. I wonder what the max pie size is in this, actually. Old loot. We'll probably want to go back down and check the uh, white side there real quick. Yeah, I figured there'd be something over here. No. And ooh. and berries. Okay, <coughs> bought me. Let's see. Oh crap! An ambush. Yay! Then poison. It's always good. Poison very very bad. Okay, so everyone tech you because we want to make sure nobody gets poison. Poison bad. Poison bad. So Die, there you go. Ah, dang it, they both play on the ground. Don't mail, it's gonna do one damage unless they pop out. Oh, that one popped out. Dang it. There we go. Not sure why he attacked that one. Unless, uh, that wasn't. No, I don't. Come on, get out. Out. Ow! There you go. There we go. Yeah, larger groups are much easier with four people. It's a little more annoying with three. So anyway, we're gonna continue up and north and all that jazz. See Yeah. The little auto pathfinding thing can be kind of weird. 
just got a mana potion. And just summon on the ground. I find it interesting there's like a giant. Hmm. Yeah, well, it looks like there's going to be a few things we're going to want to come back and look in to around here. Hmm, I see a secret lock chest. But we don't have any keys, so... We'll let them get to it in that little corner. Yeah, Bush! Crap! Get the big serpent. Yeah, it looks like we're pretty good in power. We can kill it with uh, two to sometimes three people. Eh. Stop being a jokey, jokey, jok, jokish people. Dead. Dead and dead. Okay, maybe not quite dead, but you're dead. And then you die. So yeah, good progress, good progress. Not getting much experience anymore though. So yeah. We'll continue up and we'll come back and explore a little later. A hole. Yeah. Advantage. There we go. That serpent kill. So let's just assume those two can kill it. And you attack that. And you attack that one. There we go. All oh, very nice. Okay. You can sometimes one shot him, but not always. You definitely can one shot one. And let's see if we Nope, didn't make it. One shot. Oh, that one actually got killed. Come on out of your hole. There you go. Okay. Woo! That was weird. Get a bomb. You go that way. And... No, we didn't really go that far. I was assuming we'd go back to that one. Dynamite. We're getting all kinds of explosives. Hmm. Get fall heal. Uh -oh. Here we are. Looks just like the one back home. Is unique. Our architecture is uniquely ours. Do you know who the lady is? I haven't the foggiest. It's beneath it. Oh, pun saint. Wait, from the legend? Yes, she was the one the few humans of our kind actually trusted. It seems our friend takes the legend pretty seriously. Well, if you want, if what you said about the gate at your home is true, then you'll be able to use the gate as well. Follow me. Oh my, here goes nothing. Wait for me! That was incredible. What was that? Hey now, shh, don't be fighting. Impressive technology, is it not? Technology, oh, well, cool! You see the temple head? That's our destination. Oh, there we go. 
there was there anything gonna actually try and kill us right in here? We're gonna fully explore. It don't look like there's random fights. So it looks like we're free to explore with no threat. That's good. Then we're probably gonna run into something. I smell a boss fight. But either way, we want to make sure there's nothing to... Let's not go that way yet. Uh... Oh. The door won't move. It seems it got stuck somehow. We'll have to find another way into the temple. I hear there's a secret passage somewhere. Yeah. There we go, go on a ghost. Ghost hunt. So... Okay, we're not having a walk over here. So yeah, let's go back down that one path. Let's see. Yeah, there don't really seem to be anything around here except for this one open door. Hey look, it seems something's behind these corns. Oh, sorry. Sure, I'll give it a try. It's a door. Oh, I think there's no sneeze coming. Oh, yeah, that's a door. Let's see, the mail. There are odd cold parts. Let's see. Let's take the side door. Oh. Nothing. Oi. Ooh. Nothing. Yeah. Uh -oh. That's weird. Can't move. Oh, there we go. The heck? What the world? Just moved. Let me get out of here. I have no idea what's going on. There we go. Okay, we're not going back in now. <laughs> I have no idea what's up with them. I'm hitting the action button. Whoa! Children, from here, be on very careful. This place has been abandoned for years. And who knows how many walk in these shadows. Thanks for the advice. You're welcome, my friend. Good crazy bats. So basically, there's shit here. You go that way. Well, this is an interesting track. That did. Oh. Uh -huh. Aha. Got a lot of floating platforms everywhere. Oh, did you see that? There's a chest right there. Hmm, we can't move or anything. So, yeah. So, there's a trick to... I'll try mashing the button, but I don't think it's gonna work because I can't change the direction I face. No. So there's a trick to that. Yeah, we got monsters in here. 
Let's see if they'll any stronger. Nope. Didn't see the same strength. They will attack that one, we'll have full attack that one. Mm, we'll get some bolts on our new guest. He basically has the least health. Just kind of odd, actually. Victory! I wonder if he's going to be a plummet killer, too.